<laughs> Number 30, LED street lights. Uh, motion by Mr. Ladd, second by Mr. LeBranch to recommend Article 30, tentatively number 30, LED street lights. Is there any questions or comments, Mr. LeBranch? Yes. <coughs> the question I had uh, from last week was, we, I, I watched the presentation when the salesman came in, and they're going to take the bulb out, basically, and replace it with an LED, mm -hmm. okay? Now, at that point, we own them. Yes. Uh, and we pay for the electric from that point on, yes? Just like we do we're now. doing now. Right. Yeah. Okay. But we're not going to own that arm. That still right. belongs to Unitil. Do we have to pay them rent for that thing? And, and, and as well, the arm. But down the beach, you're going to do Ocean Boulevard as well? No, the because it belongs to the state. <coughs> okay, that answers that question. Thank you. Anybody right. else? Mr. Morrow. I had a question on this. Oh, you want to tell us, tell, us, tell us your question? <laughs> I told you last week. Do you remember it? No. Obviously not. Well, you know it. it was it useful, was, though. It, was, it, it wasn't, wasn't even that. It was probably the question is, when you were going to be coming here, my question was, how much are we currently <coughs> spending per year on the existing lights? And we're going to replace them. And how much might the cost be per year once we get the new lights, so therefore we can understand how long it would take us to pay off this price. I'm assuming that we save got, enough energy to, to save it, to save money in the future. We currently pay 213000 in a rough number that I'm remembering from the budget, because right. five years ago it was two hundred, and it's now up to two thirteen for the street lights, and, and they're <coughs> And you pay whether they're on or they're not, okay? You probably didn't, weren't aware of that. No, I did not. The street lights are not metered. So what happens at the central office is they go, okay, it was dark for 8.12 hours last night times 872 structures or fixtures that use, and each one is broken down by how much it uses, and that's how they calculate your bill. Mm -hmm. So if the street light's out, you're technically still paying for it. Mm -hmm. Because within their rate structure, that's how they <coughs> capture or recapture Excuse the cost me. of those fixtures that are currently there. Mm -hmm. So what Affinity did is sit down with Unitil and say, okay, of the 872 lights, and they did it fixture by fixture, what's the buyout, if you will, of all those fixtures? The short of it is, we will save, let's say, $5,000 a month in electricity, and that's about what it is, but it's going to cost us 4000 a month to buy out half of the value, okay? The value of the streetlights is 240000 but right off the bat, Unitil says, I will give you a credit, give you back, erase, $122,000. So one half of the cost or the value of those structures, those heads, is they're going to weigh. They, but they want the other 122. And how they want it is, or how it's calculated is, we will save 5000 a month in electricity. But we will pay to Unitil 4000 of the five. So the actual savings for the first year is like $1,000. It gets better the second year, it gets better the third year, and by the That's fifth year, we're, Unitil has paid back its pure, its five, six, and seven thousand dollars of savings then. And over the course of the ten years, the total savings package is close to one million dollars. <coughs> That's uh, good planning. I love that. Yeah, so it, like it was, it. And, I, and I give the credit to Affinity and Unitil for working, Unitil for working with Affinity and Affinity having the ability to negotiate that with, um, with, uh, with Unitil. So um, they see it, we see a savings, I'm sure it helps Unitil on certain aspects, um, and, and it helps, certainly helps out the town with a number of things. Thank It'll you. be a better quality okay, lighting. Anybody else? We save money. Mr. Ladd. I just make a comment. Not only is there an economic savings, there is an environmental benefit. 
Yes, oh, there's right. a CO2 emissions reduction. Yep. That's huge. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And I think that's part of the incentive for Unitop. Very good thing. Hmm. And LED lights hold up better than yeah. flooding, too, right? right? They will. <laughs> Anything else? <laughs> in flooding? Oh, yeah, I thought yeah. you meant flood light. <laughs> no, no, I'll move Article 30. Water. <laughs> <laughs> I'll move Article 30. Second. Okay, everyone wants to vote in favor of this, right? Right. So it's unanimous. Okay, thank you.